Hello guys. Yes. Hi. So tell me, how did you come up with this music? How did you invent it? Um, it's invented through doing. And I, I lost a job and then I and then I was creating a mythological world and then I created the music for and I began creating the music for that world. So this young lady became a um, a, um, a protege of mine and a partner. So how how many years ago did you meet? Four, almost four. We're coming up in our anniversary. Oh. <laughs> So uh, you invented the music and found a partner to perform exactly. it. Exactly. That's what really happened. How lucky. <laughs> Blessed is the world. How old are you? I am. What are you? Fifty nine. I'm fifty nine. Oh really? Oh okay. And <laughs> surprised me. Didn't expect that. Oh well, you look younger, both of you. <laughs> um, so let tell me. What what do you want to do? Like, how do you see your future? What's the, what is your purpose of this music? Um, I would really like to expand the work to have a band and um, a drummer and a bassist and a harpsichordist and a cellist. Uh, I would love to have more musicians and uh, uh, acrobats and dancers and just a lot of. Choose this place, this angel tunnel. I was um, I was walking by one day a long time ago, and I was uh, just doing a walkabout, and I saw it uh, as I was walking, dancing by, singing and dancing, and I said, I gotta go in there and look at that and see. That looks that could be a pretty good sound in there. So I danced down the stairs. It was a rat, terrible place at that time. So anyway, I sang, and it's like I have to come back here. So I did, and. Uh, and it continued, I, I just became more and more devoted to the space, realizing that it was much more than just a, uh, a tunnel from one place to the next. It's actually invested with many uh, esoteric principles of Freemasonry and, uh, and uh, ancient uh, esoteric traditions. Oh, these ones? This one. So you know what all the sign, signs mean? Numbers, signs. Oh, I must go into some more investigation for this place. 